Hello everyone. Today in this video we are going to discuss about the Flipkart Grid 4.0 challenges. The notifications of Flipkart Grid 4.0 challenge has already released and also the registration process is started. So in this video we will see who are eligible for this Flipkart Grid 4.0 challenges and also we will see what will be the benefit the students will get after qualifying this say, Flipkart Grid 4.0 challenges. So, if you are new to our channel, then kindly subscribe our channel and press the bell icon so that you can get the notifications what video we are going to upload. So, let's start today's video. This is the notifications that is lead by the Flipkart. If you want to read these notifications, then you can visit at the link in the description box. First, I will going to discuss the eligibility criteria for this challenge. Here, you can see in the first point, it is mentioned that the competitions is open to the students pursuing B.Tech, B.E., M.Tech or the related engineering program across all engineering college in India and US. It means every student who is registered in BE, BTEC or MTech program or any engineering program are eligible and they should be passing in 2023, 24, 25 or 26. This is the passing year. It means students say who is pursuing engineering and will pass in the following year are eligible for this challenge. And also it is a necessary that students must register in team of two to Three members. It means that single students can't register for these challenges. They have to participate in team and the team size should be either two members or three members. The batch of 2022 is not eligible to participate in this competition. It means the students who are passing this year are not eligible for this competition. And the students say can be from any specializations. It means that students can be from mechanical, electrical, civil or any branch. And next important thing is that Suppose you are forming a group of three members, then that three members should be belongs to the same college. You can't uh, make a team with a members or a students that's it from different college. The students should belong to the same college, same engineering college. Their branch may be different, but the college should be same. And also one members uh, can be the uh, participate in only one team. It means that one student can be the member of only one team. And if a student is registering, more than one team that all the teams will be disqualified from the entire challenges. So keep in mind these are the eligibility criteria for this challenges. Now I am going to discuss about the different level of the challenges. There are three level of the challenges and in the first level, first level is the e-commerce and the tech quiz challenges. In this level, all the registered teams will take a online quiz. This quiz will help for the 30 minutes. And based on the performance in the level 1, the students will be shortlisted for the level 2. Note students say their team will be shortlisted for the level 2 and in the level 2 each team will be given a problem statement and they will have to provide the solutions of that problem statement. And based on the performance of teams in the level 2, they will be shortlisted for the national finale. And the students who will be shortlisted for the national finale will be invited to showcase their solutions to the panel of the domain expert at Flipkart. It means they will have to show their solutions to the expert or to the Flipkart. Now I am going to discuss about the different rewards and prizes that the students will get in in this challenge. Winners of this challenge will get a prize up to 1.5 lakhs and the runner will get up to 75,000 and the top 50 teams of this challenge will get the GRID goodies. And the next thing is the certificate of merit. This is the very important things. Top 20 teams per college. It means say in your college, uh, top 20 teams will get the certificate of merit. Then getting the certificate of merit, chance is very high. It means uh, most of the students will get the certificate of merit as the top 20 teams per college. That means say in your college, the top 20 teams will get the certificate of merit. Also the level one qualifying teams will get the certificate of merit finalist will also get the certificate of merit and the next important thing is the career opportunities the teams who qualify the level 2 will get a chance to be the part of hiring process for internship and the full time take roles at flipkart it means the students who qualify the level 2 will be the part of hiring process at flipkart and in the hiring process they can get a full time jobs at flipkart or the internship at flipkart also the teams who reach the finale get a PPI for the software take role for internship and the full time. It means the students or the team which get the finale, reach the finale, will get the PPI for their job roles or the internship. Now I am going to discuss about the important dates and the deadlines. 
The deadlines for this registration is 30 June quiz that is the level 1 will be held at 2 July. Level 2 will held at 17 July and the national finale, uh, finale will held at 10 August. And you can see here the, are the rewards and prizes mentioned here. These are the rewards and prizes that the students will be getting uh, in this challenge. And next things here is the you can see a start date of the registration is the 3 June, 3rd June and the end date of this challenge is 10 June that is the uh, date of the final round that is the national finale. And also you can see here the registration fee is totally free. It means you will be not uh, going to pay any fee for this registrations in the Flipkart Beat 4.0 challenges. So this is the very uh, good opportunity for the every students and every student should register for this challenge. If you have any doubt, then you can post your doubt in the comment box or you can visit at the link in the description box. So these things uh, was for this video and if you have any doubt, then you can post your doubt in the comment box. So see you in the next video. Till then, bye bye. And also if you are new to our channel, then kindly subscribe our channel and press the bell icon so that you can get the notifications what video we are uploading in this channel.